colossal importance and a stadium. Hello everyone for our coverage we pitched up here in the Midlands of England we're at the King Power Stadium my name's Derek Ray and delighted to have alongside me as usual on these occasions Stuart Robson and very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League it's Leicester City up against Aston Villa thanks Derek as always this should be a good game great atmosphere inside the stadium we've got two teams full of quality some interesting matchups and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Villa couldn't keep the ball. Foiling his opponent completely. In it goes! That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Well, as the replay shows, that's gone in off the post. His heart must have been in his mouth there. It's a good finish in the end. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Isaac. And having a goal! Full credit. Wonderful stop. And receiving news of a goal in the Luton match. Alex Scott, what can you tell us? Yep, it's a goal for Everton. It's now 1-0 with 12 minutes on the clock. Many thanks as ever, Alex. And Leicester with the ball again. An example of how to press. Well, it's tight at the top and extremely tense, just as we would want it, Stuart. Well, it looks like being a very close race for the title, doesn't it? There's nothing to choose between the teams. But can one of them just go on a great run and pull away? And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? And that is goalkeeping of the very highest order. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Being pressed and pressed high. Moussa Diaby. And he's made headway. In position. And a goal. The equaliser. Superb entertainment. So back underway. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. Kiernan Dewsbury Hall. Showing a real will to win the ball. Tielemans. Shot blocked, but still alive. Blocked again. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Disappointing for Leicester to give it away like that. Matty Cash. And giving them too much space on the flank. Isaac. Must be! And still danger here. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Well, Villa should have taken the lead, but what a good save that was. Brilliant from the keeper. Moussa Diaby and sloppy in possession from Villa incisive pass could be in here and the keeper more than equal to it well Aston Villa have had all the ball in the last 15 minutes and have looked great going forward they just need to take one of the chances they've created to get themselves ahead today now can they win back possession and create something else? And what can they do to stop him running at them? Felipe Anderson. Stopped a certain goal. Well, no more time.
And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Moussa Diaby. That's a good-looking ball. Well, it could be on for him here. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. So the action underway again. And certainly the onus is on Leicester to come up with a reply here. Steffi Mabedidi. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Diaby. Well, this is certainly the home of live football, EA TV. And looking forward to bringing you more action from the Premier League. It's Leicester City facing Everton. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. Bailey. Oh, what an opportunity. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now. And they just need to keep the concentration. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Teammates available. Might be onto something with that ball. And crossing towards the far post. And foiled only by the crossbar. And a vigorous effort off the crossbar. Well, as you said, it's a lovely strike, but a fraction too high in the end. And that's sound goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that. Tielemans. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Just a quick reminder, we'll have FA Cup quarter-final action for you live here on EA TV. It's Aston Villa taking on Ipswich Town. Well, Derek, everything to play for in that game. Place in the last four. What a game that should be. It should be really tense, it should be dramatic, and I'm looking forward to it. Well, I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Luton game. Alex Scott can fill us in. It's another goal for Everton. The goalkeeper's made an initial great save, but there's nothing he could do after that. They've pulled one back and now trail by one with 66 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Oh, surely. Yeah. And it's with Isaac. Diaby. It might be. And the keeper more than equal to it. Just knocked it out of there. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. An effective ball. Chance for Isaac. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. Goals in plentiful supply. 4 1 currently. Mabadidi. Kieran Dewsbury Hall. Now Felipe Anderson. And it's Winks. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Chances on. Can they cover up? Well, alas, the finish didn't match the build-up. Well, you're absolutely right. Not the finish they were hoping for, but an excellent counter-attack. They really do break forward quickly. Well, I believe there's been a goal in the Liverpool match. Alex Scott has the details. Yeah, it's a third goal for Liverpool. You could see he knew what he wanted to do as he stepped up to take that free kick because it was executed superbly. They now lead 3-2. Sorry to jump in. It could be on for them here. Oh, a smart stop. Well, not far away from a very difficult angle. Well, from that position, it was a really good effort. Substitution time it is here. 
And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Great ball over the top. And ready to strike. It was on its way in. And there goes the whistle for full time. The Villa fans will leave.